So Kyle talks about uh, the pipe bombs. And when earlier when they're making pipe bombs, he's like, oh, easy, easy on the pipe bombs. It's volatile. But then he gets emotional and he's no longer easy on the pipe bombs. I love you. I always have. Okay, he's emotional. Oh! Oh! The first one, maybe. The second one? Oh! Jesus. It could go off at any second. Why so is he shoving pipe bombs into a bag like this? Yeah, it could go off at any oh, second. I'm angry at you. Just shove my hand. Like, whoa, dude. Yeah. Like, whoa. Insert it in there nicely. Slip it in. I mean, just because that's his advice from earlier is to just place, you know, the pipe bomb into the bag gently. nice and gent- gently, right? Because it could mm-hmm. go off at any second. It, boom, right? boom, boom. He's angry. Oh, Kyle Reeves. Dude needs to get laid. Mm. And then he does get laid, which we will not show. Yeah. It's a family channel. Then the, the <laughs> tactical <laughs> application of pipe bombs was questionable. Let's watch. This is just this is such a difficult technique that he's trying to do here. Mm-hmm. Like so he's trying to hit from a moving vehicle to a second moving vehicle. He's lighting fuses and timing the fuse time, which means he needs to know the characteristics of that fuse mm-hmm. wire. Yep. And then he's like trying to get on the way, like in the motion. Yep. Oof, this is a, a challenging way to attack someone. Right. And he, they never actually do score a hit because yeah. it's just too challenging. Look at this. You got this. This represents some sort of time exactly. plus whatever, however long it takes to burn in here. Mm hmm. And have they calibrated by doing test bur- test bombs earlier when they're like, okay, right at this, this is 20 feet, this is 30 feet, this is 40 feet. But then you've got variable speeds of the of the vehicles. Oof. So you got to take that yeah. into account. <laughs> so I guess, I, guess, I guess the way to time it would be by seconds. This, like, this is a five-second fuse. I mean, from the start to finish, I got five full seconds. And mm-hmm. then from there, he's just guesstimating how long it takes until Anu mm-hmm. catches up. Right. You don't have much time. I mean, from mm-hmm. time from, from. I mean, it's less than a second. That's right. Which means going. he needs to cook the grenade. He needs to cook right. the pipe bomb. He needs to like hold it in his hand while it's sizzling down, right. and then throw it last second. And hopefully, there's no sudden turns or anything. So, it like you know. And hopefully, they're also far enough away so that they don't get hit with the shrapnel. That's right, because that is going to be pretty random where it, the shrapnel goes. It's just, it's a strange application of a pipe bomb. That's right. A fused pipe bomb. Maybe maybe he meant it for something else, and then he's like, well, this is what I got. Like, I got to fight the Terminator right now. Yeah, it does, it does feel a little improvised. Yeah. But maybe they should have just fired regular guns out the back. <laughs> yeah that's right that's right yeah hit, hit his tire and then he goes flipping right and i guess the target is the motorcycle because the terminator is fairly impervious to a lot of Pretty much stuff just, that's a good point yeah so you take out a tire maybe maybe hit the engine or something something just aim here kyle reese is like i had success with that big walker the johnny five walker type like i threw a grenade underneath its foot mm-hmm. i'm going to do the same thing for the t1 done mm-hmm. one under one yeah 